Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the fourth. The fourth. What do we have for around the fourth? Timing is still fluid, and not every reading is for you. For those of you that are waiting on your weeklies, they're coming, they're coming. Some of them might get done on the 4th because I had such a busy day today. But I'm trying, I'm trying. So what do we have for a message today? Three cups. So that is a celebration. That's having fun, celebrating something. Good news by the looks of things. This is some sort of happiness, okay? It's happy, joy, celebrating. Uh, looks like it's a lot of fun, whatever it is. Yay! That kind of energy. Ooh, ten of cups. This is extremely happy. So yeah, this is extreme happiness. This is a spiritual blessing of some sort. This is a happy, this is fulfillment, right? This is a, the storm is over. This is something to celebrate. Somebody's going to be celebrating something that makes them extremely happy. Ooh, King of Cups reversed. Seven of Pentacles. Now this is about an investment. Somebody is thinking, is it worth it? You know, they've been thinking about packing up perhaps going someplace else there's a lack of emotional fulfillment here there's sadness they've been thinking about something quite a bit whether they should put in effort or not you know we have somebody here that has has been emotionally withdrawn they may have not been communicating or they've been in their emotions or not listening to their intuition, but really thinking about something. Ooh, definitely not listening to their gut. Lack of faith. Fear of commitment, perhaps. Thinking about a commitment. There could, there could be, there may have been relationship issues here. Now, I, I feel like we, in the past, there's been some lack of commitment. Somebody, you know, was probably... They had an opportunity to make something grow, but they didn't put in much effort. They're probably feeling discontent at this time, sad. But there is happiness that is coming, extreme happiness. Now, this is lack of faith, not listening, having a hard time doing the right thing because of social pressure. So we do have somebody that is having a hard time doing the right thing. And it is because of social pressure. They may feel disgraced, right? They could be feeling disgraced. Hmm. Eight of Swords reversed. Now the Eight of Swords reversed is removing an obstacle. Finally, an obstacle of fear is finally being removed. Or, some, or, an, or it doesn't have to be fear, but an obstacle is definitely being removed. Maybe somebody wasn't thinking clearly, right? They were playing it safe, but now, now they're stepping out. They're breaking free from some sort of situation that they have been stuck in. All right, there could be there could be some communication coming in, some socializing, some happy news. This this could even be a reunion. There could be a reunion here with the three of cups. Whatever it is, it's celebrating, drinking. Partying, not for everybody, obviously, but the Three of Cups is is a gift. It's a, receiving a gift. Somebody could be receiving a gift, or they could just be. It seems like it's happy news. All right, um, this is an obstacle being removed, stepping outside of the comfort zone, breaking free from some sort of mental turmoil that has made somebody really unhappy. Wasn't listening to their gut. Maybe there's a commitment, breaking free from a commitment. Freedom, 
freedom. So this is a new beginning. This is we have an individual here that is uh, taking a risk. They are taking a re risk. They are finding that faith. Hmm. Leaving something behind. An obstacle is being removed. They're leaving something behind. It's fear. It is fear. Somebody is letting go of fear. They're taking a new journey. Maybe they're doing it with blind faith. They're, they're just deciding, you know, they're going to do it. They're going to do it. They're going to invest. They've been thinking about it a lot. Ooh, so this is an exciting opportunity. It is exciting. This is starting with a clean slate. Just going to do it. This is just do it. This is somebody that gets this vision. They get this desire. They have this sudden desire for happiness. So they're going to do something spontaneous. It feels like it's spontaneous. This is a fresh start. It's an exciting opportunity. It's a time of growth. It's a time of fertility. We have somebody here that probably because this is a vision they may see some opportunity for happiness and they're going for it so they are really going for it somebody is going for it now this could be a new sexual partner it doesn't have to be but this is a new exciting opportunity put it that way that will grow something has come to fruition This is the end of a battle. It's the end of a fight. Somebody was struggling. They were really, really, really struggling. Okay, but this is the end with the Five of Wands. I don't want to fight anymore. Not going to fight. I mean, this is, this is, there was, there, I feel like there's been fear of confrontation, but now somebody may be finding a solution. You know, so this is the end of a conflict. It is. I feel like there's some sudden desire to cooperate or, you know, they get this new spark, this new desire, this new drive, you know, this new uh, vision, you know, this is, you know, I want this happiness. I want it. I want this happiness. After they've been trapped, remember, wasn't it yesterday that we had the Eight of Swords upright? That's trapped. That this is getting untrapped, you know, getting unstuck. Letting go of emptiness. We have somebody here that has been feeling empty and withdrawn and they've been not communicating and they've been thinking about it though. They've been thinking about it a lot and I think they've had some fear but now they're releasing the fear and they are taking a step in a new direction. You know, they're, they're ready. They're ready. They're ready to go. That's for sure. Yeah, four of cups. There's been a missed opportunity here. Somebody has ignored an opportunity or they missed an opportunity. They were focusing on some pain, focusing on some hurt, but this opportunity has been here the whole time. This person didn't want it because they were in a situation. They were fearful. They were fearful. They were... Uh, maybe they were heartbroken, you know, they might have been heartbroken, they were too afraid to, maybe they were afraid to get rejected, or they were afraid to accept it, that it wouldn't last. They've been overanalyzing too much, somebody was overanalyzing, they were trying to play it safe, but now this obstacle of fear has been removed, or somebody has been freed, because we have freedom both these cards. So there's freedom here, freedom to choose, freedom to go in a new direction. Somebody is free to, they're free, they're free now. They may be, they may have become, or they may be free from a commitment or a marriage or a broken relationship or it could be fear, whatever. And maybe their fear was of what everybody else would say. But this is a celebration, okay? And this is extreme happiness. This is just doing it. This is the end of a battle. Knight of Cups reversed. So there may be some fear of rejection here. Um, the Knight of Cups reverses somebody that, oh, I don't know, heartbreaking. 
It's a heartbreaker. Somebody may have been lying about their feelings. This is lies. This is feelings. There could be a broken engagement here. Maybe that's what somebody has broken up. There, there could be a broken engagement or there could be, you know, an unrequited love situation that has ended. Somebody was focused on an unrequited love situation, not seeing that they had another opportunity, a better opportunity, a more uh, fertile opportunity, one that will grow, you know. There could also be some tears that are being shed. There, somebody may have been crying. You know, they've been crying. They've been in their emotions. They've been having a hard time mastering their emotions. This person may have been trying to please all the people around them, not following their own heart. But now there's some good news coming. Somebody gets this new discovery or this new desire to go in a new direction. So we do have some good news coming. There could be a message that is coming from somebody that sees an opportunity that really excites them, that is really attractive to them. Somebody's going to be taking a new approach after they have been discontent, they've been sad, they've been crying, or they've been in an unhappy partnership, or unha yeah, or unhappy marriage, or I, I mean, I'm just being honest with you, you know, some sort of commitment that they weren't happy in. Now it feels like they are broken free, and they have, and they're going to be taking an opportunity to go after something that they have seen already they've already seen it it's they've wanted it they they've wanted to go in that direction but they were battling with themselves or even with another person maybe there was a third party here you know and they and that's the obstacle that has been removed maybe it's the third party that has been removed you know that now they're free now they're free to go in the direction that you know that they've wanted to go in so anyway I feel like there is definitely some good news that is coming. I think it's very exciting. This leads somebody, they, this is like a new discovery. It leads them down a new path towards extreme happiness. So there's definitely good news arriving. Okay, there is. I feel like there's a new suitor here or there's a, there's a better suitor where, where it's like these two people have a lot in common. And it's been ignored. It's been, but this is not ignoring it anymore. You know, there could there could be somebody that is about to burst into your world. You're not looking for a relationship. You know, this is not looking for a relationship. Discontent, sad. Boom, here it is. There could be a sudden desire. You know, to just go towards that relationship or to go after this. You know. There could be, there could be going out to dinner. There could be, you know, having a date, something like that, even with the three of cups. We have somebody that is ready for new things. You know? And they're, they're courageous. You know, they're finding the courage. This is a very confident individual that, you know, this person is ready. I feel like they're ready for a relationship. After there's been sulking, there's been moping, they've been ignoring a, a, a relationship or an opportunity for love. It's like now they're ready. They got this burning desire. It's like, I want it now. You know, that's what it looks like to me. <laughs> Ooh, there's been some heartbreak. This is heartbreak. We got somebody here that's suffering, and that that may be why they want it now. Maybe they've been. This is heartbroken. This is heartbroken. So I do feel like we have somebody here that has been heartbroken. They they're extremely heartbroken. You know, and they've been suffering and they've been battling. They've been discontent. But now it's like, and this is, this is like, oh my God, it is. This is a painful separation. It's a painful situation. Somebody's been in a very painful situation. And they're distraught. They are distraught. They're distraught over probably losing an opportunity. Because this is a lost opportunity. Somebody may have waited. They may have waited too long. But I do see action being taken. With the Page of Wands, this is a and with the Ace of Wands, that's action being taken. Two Cups. 
So yeah, this is a perfect match. This is a union. This is a this is a love connection. Right? If somebody is looking for love that they missed. It's like they missed an opportunity. Now they want it and they're going for it. So anyway, that's what we got. We got somebody that is about to bark, embark on a new journey. And I feel like they've removed an obstacle that has been blocking them from a partnership. And now this new partnership is coming to fruition. Get prepared for some good news. Guess if there's a suitor here with that page of wands. There is a suitor here that is that has been heartbroken that is now looking for a relationship. They have removed some sort of obstacle and they are ready to take a risk. So Yeah, that's what I guess. So, I mean, what more can I say? I mean, that is very good news arriving. This is somebody who is confident and they have no fear. This is a fearless individual. This fearless individual may have, I don't know if they've, you know, if they've experienced heartache or they may have hurt somebody else or whatever. I feel like there's definitely a, a new connection here. Or there's going to be a reconnection. There could be a reconnection. Perhaps the third party is being removed. And the third party could be anything. Whoever this person is has been having a hard time doing the right thing. They've been thinking about it, thinking about it, thinking about it. But there's been an obstacle. Now that the obstacle has been removed, they can take action. And they're about to. So, get ready for the news. Good luck. <laughs>